have to do that Matt Carpenter had even more impressive considering he wasn't in the original lineup and he hasn't started a game for you guys in, in quite some time? Yeah, we put, we put I put him in the garage for a week and pulled him out for a spin. And that I mean, that's impressive. What he's doing, what he's done since he's gotten here. Six homers now. Um, you know, I, I think he's hit probably th three balls to the wall, too, for outs. Um, it's just... It's just been a lot of really good at bats. Tremendous play down there at third. Um, really impressive. And and you're seeing, you know, you're seeing. I think the the fruits of of some labor that he put in and over the winter time. And I know he was very curious about to go find out uh, in spring training and early this year. And 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 he's seeing the fruits of that from a guy that's been a really talented player in this league for a while clearly not just him this afternoon you got a lot of contributions up and down the order but when you set the tone like that in the first inning just just how much does that help the offense help your staff relax overall yeah i mean yeah it's great um you know it's not like we we're pounding the ball all over the place there early necessarily either it was it's just a lot of really really good at bats making making their guy work hard um you know, G, LeMahieu, Carpenter, all with just really good, really good job of controlling the zone there. And then Kiner gets a big hit. Um, just just quality at bats that set the tone for the day. You've continually said Higashioka will get going. We've seen it during spring training. But what do you think it meant to him to to be able to drive the ball a little bit today? Yeah, great. Um, good to see him really, really get into one. Um, we know he's capable of that, and uh, it's a long season, and uh, we'll see some more of that. Susan? On the field, Matt had said that the best thing was the play that he made at third base because he felt like he was a player. Do you understand that feeling that he was out there and for the first time in quite a while? Yeah. Um, it was a great play, by the way. Um, I thought he made another good play to his left, kind of slowly hit ball where he kind of got to move across and, and make a good play. Um, yeah, you know, <clears throat> it's been such a joy to be around since he's got here. You know, a guy with his track record, a guy with his resume, a guy that's had his career that's just come in here and, you know, you can tell every day just excited to be here and uh, has has – jumped right in with those guys and and become a huge part of this and 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 in the opportunities that he's 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 gotten he's obviously taken full advantage of and really excited that he's on our team lindsay um i'm assuming you were pretty familiar with carpenter previously yeah. how how different does does his approach at the plate in his swing look to you now versus kind of historically no I, I think it I think it resembles who he who he's been and and who he was when he was a really good player in this league so um so there's nothing that I'm seeing like in in whatever subtle adjustments that he made that you know he wanted to improve on the last couple of years um you know he looks like the Matt Carpenter you know I've watched you know as an all-star player with the Cardinals